peeps welcome to Mariah's Beauty Corner today's video is going to be a review on this electric eyelash curler that I received for Christmas but as always you know the new little thing I got going on now where I zoom you guys in a little bit closer and give you the details on the makeup I'm wearing so let's just hop right on in to it let's see if I can like all right all right I finally got it all right so today's makeup obviously is very pink extremely Barbie-esque and on my eyes I just put a hot pink in the crease and like a champagne color on the lid still rocking the same cherry blossom 523 lashes and I did wings again I'm super proud of myself yeah, they came out pretty easy too. And on my lips is a combination of two lip glosses. So now I'm gonna zoom you out and show you the actual products I used. Okay. All right. Oh, okay, first for my crease, I used this Amuse Smoky Eyes Single Shadow in Lava Love. Eyeshadow. It was one dollar from Shop Miss A. And on my lid, I used Marzipan from the Too Faced Chocolate Bar Palette. It's a really pretty champagne color. Then for my inner corner, I used this LA Colors Duo Eyes Shadow Pencil. And what is the name? Oh, in bubbly. And I put this light color on my inner corner first. Then I went on top of it with this kind of metallic-y, bronzy color. And that's how I got my inner corner highlight. Then, oh, lashes. The 523 Cherry Blossom Lashes. <laughs> And for my lips, I use my Nikka K Lip Shine Liquid Lipstick in Magenta. And that's just um, a matte hot pink lipstick. And then to add some shine to it, I went over with the Nikka K Lip Color in Madeira. Oh, this was $1.29 from the beauty supply store. And this lip gloss was $2.99 from the beauty supply store. This was $1 from Dollar Tree. Uh -oh. And I want to say this chocolate, is it $46 from Sephora? I'm not sure. I purchased it a while ago. All right, now that's all the deets on my makeup. Let's jump into this review. Now, the electric eyelash curler that I'm going to be reviewing for you all today is from the company Secret Face. And for those of you that aren't aware of what Secret Face is. During the holidays, uh, Valentine's Day, Mother's Day, Christmas, Walmart has these um, makeup sets and most of them are by this company, Secret Face. Now I received one for Christmas. It was an eye deluxe kit. It had eyelashes, eyeshadow, eyeliner, mascara, and it also came with this electric eyelash curler. Now, I have never used an electric eyelash curler before, so I was really excited. Usually, I just curl my lashes with a manual eyelash curler, and this is a gold eyelash curler that I bought from Shop Miss A. Again, $1. It's really cute. I was browsing on the um, Icing by Claire's website, and I saw one of these, and I thought it was so cute, and I like 13 bucks for it. So, of course, I went over to Shop Miss A and found one for one dollar now this is what the curler looks like this is the curler this red rod or this red piece has a metal strip of wire running through it and when you turn on this on button the green light comes on and they say you're supposed to wait till this red band turns white and then you curl your eye your eyelashes for 10 to 15 seconds see it's 
it's already turning white. And you, you're supposed to turn it this way. So this way is supposed to be facing your eyelid. At first I did it backwards and was trying to figure out why it wouldn't fit the curve of my eyeball. But this piece right here is supposed to face your eyeball. So you put it on there and then you press this little button up for 10 to 15 seconds and the result is amazing. Now like I said earlier, I have never used an electric eyelash curler, but now that I have, I don't think I'll be reaching for my manual curlers anymore. Now, I will say this, um, when I applied it to my eye, it was radiating heat. Not too much heat, obviously, I didn't burn myself, but I wasn't used to it. So just beware of that. Um, Secret Face isn't a brand that Walmart regularly carries, so I can't um, refer you to their website to pick this up because I googled Secret Face and I couldn't even find a website for their products. So, but if you are interested in purchasing an electric eyelash curler, just beware that the heat might take some getting used to. And I say that I will be using this one from now on because my eyelashes stayed curled. Like before I, uh, because I tested it out before I started doing my eye makeup and my eyelashes stayed curled all the way up until I applied my mascara. Now since I wear falsies, um, I don't usually notice whether or not my eyelashes uh, fall throughout the day because they have on mascara which you know adds a layer of protection as far as keeping them curled goes and I don't curl my falsies but when I curl my natural eyelashes because I curled uh, my right eye with this one and then I curled my left eyelashes with this one and I noticed that the left side fell and that's something I never paid attention to because I I've never used an electric eyelash curler, but now I see why they're so awesome. Now this one does take two AAA batteries in the back. I don't know about other electric eyelash curlers. This one takes two AAA batteries. And I love this thing. I'm going to insert a picture right now of uh, the right eye with the manual eyelash curler and the left side with the electric eyelash curler. And you'll be able to tell the difference. I, I love this thing. I'm so happy that I finally have one. Like I said, it came in a makeup bundle, so I can't give you an exact price point on this product. But I will definitely say that if you're someone who's into makeup, um, preferably someone that likes to wear mascara or someone who has trouble keeping their eyelashes curled, a heated eyelash curler might work for you a lot better than a manual one. And I'm assuming it works so well because the heat helps lock in the curl, like when you use a curling iron on your hair. I think that's pretty much the, the same ideology behind a, a electric eyelash curler, but it's definitely worth checking out. Um, that concludes this video. It was just a short video of me giving my thoughts and opinion on my Secret Face electric eyelash curler. Please let me know down below in the comments what you thought of the video, if you've tried an electric eyelash curler yourself if you ran across um, a brand that you think makes a really nice eyelash curler, I would love to know that down below because I am always trying to find the best, most innovative makeup products as well as tools that are out there on the market. So until next time, I'll see you later. Bye!